Hi, and welcome to Mods. We're keeping you connected to inspiring science with virtual camp discovery brought to you by Citrix, the museum's official innovation partner. Set your imagination on fire as we go behind the scenes to meet Delilah, the Mods makerspace dragon. We'll show you how Delilah breathes fire using super flammable hydrogen. Hi, welcome back to Mods. So we're here in our maker space where we're always tinkering around, coming up with new things to do. And sometimes when we come up with something really cool, we feel compelled to show it off really any chance we get. So Alina and the team have been working hard on this uh, for the past couple weeks or so. And uh, well, what are we looking at here? Well, Brady, number one, I like to say welcome to my beautiful dragon's den. This okay. is Delilah. She's the newest addition to our mods family. Okay. and. Uh, Tell us a little bit about Delilah. What are we looking at here? Now, Delilah is a wingless dragon. Yes. Wingless dragon. Yes. Okay. So, just like reptiles in real life, dragons come in variety. Some don't have legs. Some don't have wings. Some just have wings and a body. Some Fair are enough. just like giant snakes. Okay. So, Delilah, he didn't mean to insult you. You are still a dragon, despite the wings. So, Delilah here is our newest little fire-breathing contraption. She's composed entirely of cereal boxes and cardboard and a whole lot of awesome paint. Okay. Now. You said fire breathing. Yes. She's so this thing is going to breathe fire? Yes. That's what makes her a dragon, is that she's able to breathe fire. Okay. And it's made out of cardboard and cereal boxes? Yes. Okay. So how does that work? Well, we are scientists, so we are professionals at making special effects, right? Okay. So Delilah here, what you might notice is her beautiful silvery tongue. Open your mouth, my darling. There we go. Delilah has a beautiful silvery tongue sticking out here. Now the secret to fire breathing in fantasy is this idea that dragons have this kind of flammable gas sac inside of their body that they're able to pressure forward and when they spark their teeth in some way, it's able to light it and start the fire. So. Delilah doesn't have any of those organs, unfortunately, but that's why she needs us to do the job for her. So what this rig is, it is utilizing a long plastic PVC pipe, and this actually goes a long, long way, just like her intestines. So when we go back here, it is hooked up to a very, very special type of balloon. Now in this balloon is not oxygen, it is instead hydrogen. Now, anyone, anyone who's been here before has seen our Kaboom show knows that hydrogen is the secret to all of our awesome uh, fire demos. Very, very explosive, very flammable. Yes, yes. He, uh, hydrogen is super flammable, very explosive, and great for special effects. So the way we rig this thing up, the reason why it's not flowing out is there is, in fact, a special valve back here that basically holds our hydrogen back, and when we open it up, it will pressure all of that gas forward and we'll light our fire. Okay. Now you might notice she has a little candle right in front of her. Unfortunately, she can't click her teeth together yet. Okay. She's working on it, needs some dental work. But we can show you her great fire breathing ability. You care to see? Absolutely. All right, make sure you keep your glasses on. Remember when you're working with any kind of fire breathing creature, you don't want to lose your eyebrows. One, two, three. Beautiful job, my darling. You are amazing. Wow. See, I told you she was a real dragon. Very much so. All right. So this is Delilah, the fire-breathing dragon. Alina, uh, one of our chief architects here. And I'm Brady. And the dragon keeper. Uh, thank you for joining us. Hopefully you get to come down here and see Delilah someday soon. Uh, but until then, we'll see you again. Bye. Thank you for joining us for this episode of Virtual Camp Discovery. Special thanks to Citrix, Mod's official innovation partner for powering this series. Please stay safe and connected with Mods by visiting our social channels at MODSFTL.